What if the world you woke up to tomorrow was engulfed in conflict? What if the sounds of birds chirping were replaced by the echoes of explosions and the cries of innocent lives lost? This is not a dystopian novel. This is a reality for the residents of Gaza, where a recent war has left indelible scars on its people and landscape. Our narrative begins in early August 2022, on a weekend that would prove devastating for Gaza. Palestinian militants in response to Israeli airstrikes, launched rockets towards Jerusalem. The tit-for-tat escalation of violence resulted in numerous casualties and significant infrastructural damage. The key players in this conflict were Hamas and Islamic Jihad, both of whom found themselves in the crosshairs of the Israeli Defense Forces. As the conflict intensified, so did the death toll. More than 40 people lost their lives in just that one weekend. But the casualties were not limited to the battlefield. Innocent civilians found themselves caught in the crossfire, their lives upended by a war they did not choose. The violence, the most severe since May 2021, drew the attention of the international community. The United Nations in particular prioritized humanitarian aid, focusing on restoring fuel and electricity supplies to the ravaged region. But as the world grappled with the humanitarian crisis unfolding in Gaza, the political complexities of the situation also came to the fore. One such complexity was the involvement of Iran. The leader of Islamic Jihad had recently visited Iran and received support, further complicating the geopolitical dynamics of the conflict. Israel's Prime Minister highlighted Iran's role in backing Islamic Jihad, adding another layer to the already tangled web of Middle Eastern politics. Despite the escalating violence, hope for a ceasefire remained. Intermediaries from Egypt were working tirelessly to mediate between the warring factions, striving to bring about a cessation of hostilities and establish a fragile peace. To summarize, the recent war on Gaza was a complex interplay of geopolitical maneuvering and human tragedy. Sparked by Israeli airstrikes and Palestinian retaliation, the conflict saw the involvement of militant groups like Hamas and Islamic Jihad. The death toll was high, with more than 40 people losing their lives in one weekend alone. The UN stepped in to provide humanitarian aid, and Egypt tried to mediate a ceasefire. The situation was further complicated by Iran's support for Islamic Jihad, as highlighted by Israel's Prime Minister. In a world where peace seems increasingly elusive, the war on Gaza serves as a stark reminder of the human cost of conflict. As we navigate the intricacies of international politics, let us not forget the innocent lives caught in the crossfire, the ordinary people for whom war is not a choice, but a harsh reality.